all the surf forecasting sites said the waves were going to be really big today and i'm looking at it now and it's so fucking hard to judge how big it is and i mean it's hard enough at the best of times when people are calling you know three foot waves six foot and six foot waves eight foot you know and calling a shoulder high wave and an eight foot wave when clearly you don't have an eight foot high shoulder it doesn't make any fucking sense so that's why i've always gone off the the german backpacker scale if you see there's 15 to 20 german backpackers out there it's probably only going to be like shoulder high quite small uh, then if you've got like three to four German backpackers out, they're going to be a lot bigger, you know, maybe overhead, a little bit overhead. And then uh, generally if there's no German backpackers out there, it's going to be quite solid. The waves are going to be quite good. So if someone will ask me, you know, how big are the waves out there? And I'll say, it's like, you know, it's four German backpackers. And they're like, oh, okay, I'll take out my twin pin. Like 15 to 20 German backpackers out there. And they're like, oh, okay, well, I might just flag it or take my soft top out for a bit of fun. 75 to 85 German backpackers out there. And then someone's probably going to be like, well, what the fuck is up with immigration? Why are they letting so many German people in here on a tourist visa? I'm going to take out my stand-up paddle board. So it's a good way of actually judging how big the waves are. Um, but at the moment, it's been pretty fucked because of the whole borders being closed of the pandemic and that. And there's been no fucking German backpackers around. So it's extremely difficult to try and figure out how big those waves are. It's been absolute fucking shizer, to tell you the truth.